Is it Loser Semis? Chat. Is it Loser Semis? Oh, he's close from Puerto Rico. Rico. Oh, nice. Yo, PR. Two, one, go. PR representation. Good to see some Puerto Rico representation, man. Excellent for Headshot for making it out here at MSN. Big shouts to all you guys from Puerto Rico coming in here to the Twitch channel. Great to see some representation Ooh, from Puerto Rico. I haven't seen that before. I haven't seen Down Throw Up Smash with Samus before. Okay. Thank That's you probably chat. a Bowser exclusive. Thank you, chat, for helping me out. It is Loser Semis. Bounce accidentally closed Smash.gg. I apologize. It's okay. I mean, it's not like I told you it was Loser Semis, but you know, it's good to have Twitch chat here this is, this is, tell this you is what I just told you. Good stuff, man. See, this is anyway. Why, this is why I need you in my live streams. It's all good, bro. It's all good. Anyways, up, up throw from Leon. Yeah, that was clean. I, I mean, so I'm looking at the matchup and I'm like, okay, Samus is going to like, you know, wall up Bowser, have all these, you know, projectiles, but Leon's just not really caring about it that much. He's just finding the openings, kind of rushing Samus down. Oof. And he dares off stage. I didn't want to say you gave this man all the credit, but <laughs> at the off stage, I will like never you gave him say anything good about Leon again. You know, I, I guess I just have to curse people. Oh man, I thought he was going for it. I, I thought so too, man. But here on this one, it's big damage. 108 to headshot. Excellent use of bomb ball to kind of slowly come back under the stage here and avoid a lot of opportunities from Leon. Surprising sure he didn't go for fair or something like back air, but nonetheless here, Leon taking some time to hold the stage control. Ooh, okay. big. See, that's the problem here. You're at high percent. You don't want to go for a roll. You don't want to get called out by Leon here. But don't forget, you do lose stage. I'm sorry, ledge invincibility the higher your percentage. Yeah, you can't hold him to the ledge that long when you're high percent. And uh, yeah, Leon recognizes that. Okay. Good. See, and I think I think Headshot has to also understand the same way that X who had to learn. You have to play this matchup like a zoner. You can't be too aggressive. I do Ooh. like these bomb ball lead-ins here, man. Able to cover so much and get the forward smash here. Headshot definitely correcting my error. Yeah, he's uh, really good at using the down beat to confirm into these strong hits. I saw him get the downer out of that earlier. Down throw up smash. Yeah, that has to be the Bowser exclusive. Man. Yeah, that, that, that definitely does. That was so big, he gets hit by that. Good for headshot. Nice. Oh. What a call up right before the starting frames of that downer activation. Double up there into the quick screw attack here, man. Headshot is not giving Leon everything for free just yet here. Looking for the landing opportunity, saving the jump and the bomb ball to get center stage. Great movement from headshot. Back throw. Bomb ball yet again. Oh, Leon recognized that he went high. That was yeah. really good. Oh, no. Everything. Caught in the end lag. Right. Yeah, the, the missile didn't even hit him either. That's the worst part. It actually completely missed. Yeah, it did. It actually did. And Leon taking game one. I talked about it earlier too, right? You got you got to play this like a little bit more of a zoner here. Some situations that we do see headshot go for a great edge guard is when he goes for the bomb ball at that specific opportunity. It's really good because it forces you to get out from ledge and it's got a decent actual bounce. Never forget the bomb ball, the actual bomb bounce does damage to the shield. There's some crazy things you can do with Samus. We've seen Quick do that as well. Headshot was definitely right on the money. He's definitely looking really clean here. I like that here from Gladi Hater, but he still got to play this a little bit differently here, man. He gave Leon a little bit too much of the control and a little bit too much of the close and quarters counter here. You have to respect that whirling fortress that helped be out of shield for Bowser. Three, two, Ooh, we're on FD. One. Yeah, I think the projectiles is definitely gonna fly in this match. Just, just my uh, educated assumption. Leon, though, man, he, I think he recognizes too. With the space of the stage, Samus wants to start, you know, setting up the projectiles. He's just trying to rush Samus down as much as possible. Oh. Yeah, maybe rushing a little bit too much. That was a very good uh, check there from headshot. Like, all right, you're gonna use your double jump off stage. To try to chase me out here. I I'm gonna take that. Thank you for the free stock. Okay. Nope, not gonna be anything too crazy. He's gonna charge up the full charge shot. Actually, that's good for him. Nice, and he gets that perfect opportunity. I actually go around Bowser's four. It's a wow, what a combo missed on the downer, but great from headshot to get the corner carry right from the ledge and the back air to push oh. himself back on the stage. Wow, he is punishing Leon. Yeah, headshot. Oh, never mind. <laughs> he just gets back air in the face. <laughs> he was doing amazing though. That's yeah, yeah. 100%.
He corner carried this man right from the ledge, man. Right from a forward air. Oh, yeah. I'm loving the FD pick right now for headshot. He just has so much more space on the stage. Yeah. And I like it, too. He was looking for the cross-up on that jump here. A little bit of that movement here. Gets both hits of neutral air. Really, really seen by I talked about. It. You got to respect Rolling Fortress. Respect the pace off with the forward smash here. And this is a good lead for a headshot here. Two stocks, 0%. This man is untouched with a couple aerials here. Yeah, I love the up airs as well. Bowser's so big. Uh, yeah, and Samus doesn't always get to, you know, take advantage of her up air strings like that. But versus a big character like this, it's going to lead to a lot of punishment. Headshot's taking full advantage. Love the bomb play at the ledge as well. If he got that to connect properly, he might have been able to get it to uh, work with the down air spike. Oh, great cross up here. Using the bomb ball as well to get that extra boost. I like it. Doesn't want to try to fight for the center stage because he doesn't want to commit to a roll against Leon's command grab. Shield. Questionable roll here. Really scary. I thought Leon might have punished that, but here he gets oh. the back air. Seeing the jump with no movement, with no aerial. Jump. Oh. What a cross up. What a In cross up. The, uh, back air. Wow, that was actually really good movement from the ledge. Leon didn't know which way he was going. That was a very dominant game two from Headshot. Yeah, that, that FD pick working wonders for Headshot specifically. Yeah, it's a, it's, a, it's a lot of opportunities where like now we're starting to see Headshot go for our, some different mix-ups. I do like a little bit of how he's zoning here and there just, just between him and Leon, but also kind of changing the timing between his aerials. Getting, getting cross-ups, getting the bomb ball, all that movement that he was able to put up against Bowser. Strong stuff, but also the one thing that definitely helped that I mentioned earlier here, it is going to be his respect towards the Whirling Fortress. That punishment there is so good to be able to do against Bowser. Ready? Don't respect it, man. If you don't respect Whirling Fortress, you don't respect even up smash as well. You will lose a lot. Yeah, I like that headshot actually is in the... Uh, he's mixing up offense and... Uh, Camping a lot, actually. He's not just being one dimensional in how he uses projectiles. I think that's really throwing Leon off a little bit. Okay, so the uh, charge miss lastly does go through the flame breath. That's good oh, frame. nice. Calls out the jump. Oh, second missed forward air, but still good for headshot. Good percent on Leon here, but like I said, you gotta be careful. Too aggressive there. That is rolling forward to 60% for Leon. And a back air with the flamethrower here. That's good for Leon making the comeback already. Yep, there it is. I won fortress at the ledge. Leon gets a lot of mileage out of that move. Oh, yeah, <laughs> three of them. <laughs> Just took him three whirling fortresses and a flamethrower, and he already had the lead here. But headshot finally at center stage control. Wanted him to go for the jump, forcing it out, missing the Zare just narrowly. And Leon finds an opening with the backer of his own. A lot of shield pressure here. Okay. Oh, nice. You nice. got center stage. Oh, you can get the sweet spot on the episode, though. Not enough. That was a little bit too big. Oh, he, uh, that was smart too. So he goes for that situation there because he already hit Bowser, but he wanted to force Leon jump to jump. And Headshot's been doing an excellent job just going for that premeditarily. So he's able to just get those big punishes, specifically on Leon for going for jump. And he finally gets here the forward air and the lead for Headshot. He's got to be careful here. 110. Leon can tie that up with any aerial. Oh, try to snag him in the air with the forward air, but just barely missing. And there's the up tilt. Leon definitely makes use of that move when he can find an opening. Very strong tilt for Bowser. Okay. He's going for these dares on shield pretty often. Leon hasn't really gotten opened up by that move just yet. If anything, he's consistently punishing him for going for it. But that one will connect into the, the screw attack. Decent percent here for headshot. Okay. Oh my. That's so scary. But wow, nice. Great up B. Yeah, you gotta watch that bounce on the down air from Leon. He can actually get combo that into up smash if he's ready for it. Okay, he's going for a smart bomb play at the ledge. <laughs> Definitely oh, smart bomb play because he gets he's able to cross up Bowser even from the ledge. Get up the poor rolling option there, and that's good for Leon with the rolling fortress, putting headshot in such a tough spot to be in. Nice, there's the respect and the punish. He's off. Bomb Ball's here to kind of catch the opportunity for the landing here, but narrowly missed. Oh, okay. Speaking of Nair. Oh, it kind of got greedy off stage. I got the ledge again. Leon trying to find an opening. No up smash. There's a flying slam. Not enough. Full charge right. shot. He's able to come yeah, yeah. back here. Yeah. Full charge. Save the jump here with the Bomb Ball. Careful. Nice. Oh, man. Missed the grab. Oh, he missed the grab, but I'm glad you didn't give Leon the roll he was looking for, and that's going to allow him to get the beer verse charge shot. Had all that time charge off stage. Okay. Yeah. 
Not giving Leon the roll he was looking for. Definitely helped him get the charge shot on the B reverse here. Oh, nearly missing the up air, but that's definitely oh. not for not here because he gets oh, the that's charge that's shot. Big pressure here with the corner carry all the way, but no. unfortunately, not enough to come back on the stage here. But look at the lead headshot has on Leon. 80% here, and he's able to whiff against the neutral air. Come towards slightly towards the stage here, but now he's back in disadvantage here. Leon, double forward air. Stage control here. What's the play here for headshot? So much percent. Oh my god, catch the up air too. Headshot's in a lot of trouble, but avoids the flying slam. I really like that movement. The cross up back air to the up air. Sinks in the forward air too. Okay. What's the man going to do to get off the ledge? He's under a lot of pressure. Oh, I don't like that block. Hey, but back air. He spot back air. And it's so, so smart. There too. Yeah, it's so smart because Leon sees the opportunity to come off the ledge. He sees the bomb balls. He sees the commitment here from Headshot. And then Headshot's off the ledge. Leon says, let me get off. Let me come back towards center stage. Get the stage control. And then now it's Headshot who sees that opportunity as more of a cross-up, double back air, and then takes the game here, pushing the Headshot at 2-1 and set point, ladies and gentlemen, here. Those are semis. Leon with the quick run it back here. Oh, he's running it right back. Okay, let's see. Let's see if we can bring this to game five. Hey, everybody, looking. can I get an F in the chat for Arrows 15K, man? I'm sorry, bro. Two, one, <laughs> Who knows? Leon's a very good player, man. And I think these guys played earlier. I think Leon might be the one. Uh, wait, no. Did I think Headshot might have sent Leon to the losers? I can't remember. Uh, I don't know. I no, no, no. Guys... Uh, perhaps, uh, X who sent Leon. To the I was gonna say. I'm pretty sure it was X. Yeah, we yeah, yeah. yeah, never mind. Never mind. They haven't played in this tournament. Maybe in a separate tournament they played. But uh, right now, yeah, Headshot, a lot of control, just taking Leon from left to right on the stage right now. Nice. He's actually able to sneak through the roller fort this time around here. And yeah. Headshot, once again, bomb ball plays to force the oh, opportunity. Yeah. The air dodge on Leon. He didn't want to get hit, but he paid too much to just Ooh. avoid something so small. Dang, he dropped his combo there. That could have been a lot of percent. Yeah. But yeah, Headshot saw that SD and he's capitalizing heavily. Leon, not the way, the way you want to start out this game, especially since he's facing elimination right now. Headshot's so hard to hit. Okay. Gonna get a decent charge on the, the shot right now. Yeah, back throw. Good stuff for headshot once again. The bomb ball plays and the get up attack. Yeah, I really like his down B uses at the ledge. Very, very consistent. Oh, but there's the drop kick yet again. Leon sneaks it in once more. 97% though. Can you imagine, bro? You're like a thousand pound turtle <laughs> dragon thing, and you can just back air with absolutely no, almost no impact. <laughs> like, he needs it. <laughs> I just say the context of it, like, you know. anyways, back to the match. That's not important here. Headshot, stage control. Come in with the forward air, no cross up, but he sneaks in the back air by stalling that last chance opportunity to get it in. Oh man, Leon's on on the ropes right now. Headshot's looking poised to bring this to the losers' finals, three one over Leon. He's he's gonna have to dig deep on this one. You have headshots fine with going to the ledge here. Nice. Ooh, Good ooh, changes here. We saw that little bit of angled shield there from Leon. First time we've seen it tonight. But unfortunately, shield too small. Zero, I'm sorry, Sam is able to poke through. Leon almost with the forward air. Missed whiff grab, a down throw for a headshot, missing the nair. That's something you typically see that uh, Quick actually does. He'll go for down throw nair, because it's a definitely a good opportunity for Samus to get in damage. But also, like, it's, it's a tough timing. Nope, no near back air here. Leon, he's looking for something to take the stock. Even the back air is not enough at this percent. Nice, oh. he whiffs that, whiffs nice. that, smart. Punish. Leon is still in the recovery here, oh, nice. For it. He's fighting for his life. Leon okay. with the roll rate on the up tilt. Great coverage here from the front and behind on Bowser. Leon still fighting here at 107. Potentially his last stock in this tournament. He's trying to make something happen. He's that's such a huge deficit. Okay. No. Oh, it is enough. Wow. Even Heavy Bowser's gone from that. So Headshot's gonna close that out with the JV. No percent taken. Three one over Leon. Leon's unfortunately not making it to the loose finals of things. But great stuff for Headshot. Very, 